The Big Five traits, also known as the five-factor model, are widely regarded as the most scientifically sound way of conceptualizing human personality. This model proposes that personality can be measured along five major dimensions, each of which is distinct and independent from the others. Let's explore these dimensions in detail and understand why they matter for parents. Openness to experience is characterized by curiosity, creativity, and a willingness to explore new ideas and activities. Individuals high in openness are imaginative, open-minded, and enjoy seeking out new experiences. They may be more inclined to pursue artistic or intellectual endeavors and tend to embrace change and novelty. On the other hand, individuals low in openness are more practical, conventional, and prefer familiarity over novelty. Understanding your child's level of openness can help you support their interests and encourage their intellectual and creative development. For example, if your child shows a high level of openness, you might expose them to a variety of experiences, such as art classes, museum visits, or outdoor adventures, to nurture their curiosity and creativity. Conscientiousness reflects on a person's level of organization, responsibility, and self-discipline. Individuals high in conscientiousness are reliable, diligent, and strive for achievement. They are likely to set goals, follow through on commitments, and prioritize tasks effectively. Conversely, Individuals low in conscientiousness may struggle with procrastination, disorganization, and impulsivity. Understanding your child's level of conscientiousness can help you guide them in developing important life skills such as time management, organization, and goal setting. Providing structure, routines, and positive reinforcement can support their efforts to become more responsible and disciplined individuals. Extroversion refers to a person's level of social ability, assertiveness, and enthusiasm for social interaction. Extroverts are outgoing, energetic, and thrive in social settings, enjoying the company of others and seeking out new experiences. Introverts, on the other hand, are more reserved, introspective, and may prefer solitary activities or smaller social gatherings. Understanding your child's level of extroversion can help you create environments that suit their social preferences and support their social development. For example, if your child is introverted, you might provide opportunities for them to socialize in smaller, more intimate settings or encourage them to pursue interests that they can enjoy independently. Agreeableness reflects on a person's tendency to be cooperative, empathetic, and considerate of others' feelings. Individuals high in agreeableness are compassionate, trusting, and value harmony in their relationships. They are inclined to be helpful, cooperative, and supportive of others. In contrast, individuals low in agreeableness may be more skeptical, competitive, or self-centered. Understanding your child's level of agreeableness can help you foster positive social interactions, empathy, and cooperation. Teaching them the importance of empathy, kindness, and compromise can contribute to their ability to build and maintain healthy relationships with others. Neuroticism refers to a person's tendency to experience negative emotions such as anxiety, depression, and moodiness. Individuals high in neuroticism may be more prone to worry, stress, and emotional instability while those low in neuroticism tend to be more emotionally stable and resilient in the face of adversity. Understanding your child's level of neuroticism can help you provide them with appropriate support and coping strategies to manage stress and negative emotions. Teaching them skills such as mindfulness, emotional regulation, and problem solving can empower them to navigate life's challenges more effectively. It's important to note that individuals are not simply one trait or another, but rather fall along the spectrum for each dimension of personality. Your child may exhibit a combination of traits at varying levels, and their personality can change over time as they grow and develop. In conclusion, the Big Five traits offer valuable insights into your child's personality and behavior, providing a framework for understanding their unique strengths, weaknesses, and preferences. By recognizing and appreciating these differences, Parents can tailor their parenting approach to better meet their child's needs and support their development. Thanks for watching and have a great day.